Hey guys, Sunny here. So I just wanted to give a quick update on today's trading. Uh, today turned out to be a pretty good day, uh, better than I expected actually. Uh, I was invested in uh, cold, and as you can see, uh, cold uh, natural gas has uh, fallen down considerably today, and uh, I made pretty good money investing on cold. So uh, you can see my uh, screen here uh, today I made uh, $2,000 dollar, $2,777 and 76 cents uh, that's a lot of sevens in that today um, you know if you look at my video from yesterday and day before and some videos from last week also you know I was uh, bearish on a natural gas because we have a lot of stockpile of gas and uh, you know not not the weather is not going to be that cold so I was quite bearish, um, you know, given the pandemic, uh, the price of about $3 for the gas was like extremely high, you know, uh, I would say the normal price range should be uh, 2.3, 2.5, you know, so it's possible that it's going to fall down quite a bit, but you know, it has fallen a um, lot more than I had expected, uh, I'll show you my trades. Um, you know, I, I sold loss of my stocks at 43.20 and the current price for cold at market close was about 43.73 you can see a big range in our bid and ask um, you know it's quite possible that it's going to turn around from here uh, and therefore i have sold all my stocks i have zero shares left for cold and you know like uh, i i definitely could invest in boil boil but I am not sure whether it's going to go up or uh, uh, the natural gas prices will continue to fall tomorrow. Um, I will make that decision tomorrow whether to buy boil or not. But uh, I think overnight uh, natural gas may recover some because uh, you know if you look at the 20 day chart and 180 day chart uh, you can see that uh, uh, you know the stock is near uh, near the uh, over near the oversold position uh, it's in the oversold area so let me switch my uh, screen to 20 minutes so you can see in within 20 minutes chart uh, it's already in oversold area MACD is already so low and uh, you can see it's lower than the previous lows so uh, there's good chance that uh, the prices will recover some and it looks like it's already started to recover as you can see this the last candle here it's uh, already started to recover some but uh, I will let it run uh, to how much ever it runs overnight and then tomorrow I will buy, buy uh, cold, cold again so that was uh, an update for, for today um, if you are invested in in cold, you know I would suggest to close your positions because uh, the chances of natural gas uh, prices going up is higher now than it continuing to fall down. So you know, like in stock market, we we trade based on probabilities. Um, the probabilities of the prices going higher is 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 higher than the prices going lower. But overall, the natural gas market seems to be bearish, you know, um, so it may recover some and then it will continue to fall down. That's, uh, that's what my, my, my analysis is. Uh, your analysis, is, analysis can, could be different than mine. But, uh, uh, you know, according to my, my analysis, uh, it's a good time to close out the positions on cold. So once again, my profit today two thousand seven hundred seventy seven dollars and seventy six cents it was a great day if you guys have any questions leave me a comment uh, if you guys wanna know how I trade uh, you know I always go live during the day uh, the first few hours are like very very uh, choppy you know things move really fast so I do trade but you know it's uh, I need to focus a lot more on trading so I'm not able to make videos or do a live live stream early morning hours. 
So about 11 a.m., 10, 10.30 a.m., you know, the market kind of slows down a bit so that I can, like, uh, do live streaming and trading simultaneously. All right, guys. Talk to you soon. Take care. Bye.